Hey guys, so a lot of you may know, I'm not a big night photography guy, but today we're going to be learning how to do some night photography with um, Yusuke, or Natsang, from Tokyo SPC. And today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be shooting at night in this place called Ikebukuro. And at this point I've been shooting for a few hours and all I'm doing is waiting for Yusuke to come. And today the light is just so good I didn't want to miss it so that's why I came a bit early to shoot. It's really, it's really nice as you can see. And uh, I think there's many ways of shooting night photography. Um, and Yusuke is pretty subject oriented like he goes very close to the subject and then he might use flash or something. And I thought that in comparison if I do something more like abstract and using available light and then looking more at shapes and colors today then that'll be interesting so today that's the theme of the video we'll be we'll be experimenting with different ways of shooting night photography in tokyo ばい。じゃあ。はい、ありがとうございます。今日はウルトラマックス。ウルトラマックス。ISO400で。はい、そうです。これもね、壊れてて、1回じゃ閉まらないといけない。うまくこう閉まった。FM2。FM2。オッケ
maybe they were doing something sketchy actually and it was they were just a pain and then they didn't get off our backs for like 20 minutes and I mean it was fine but then we just didn't feel very comfortable after that we just it was it was a bummer right so we just stopped taking photos actually after that I mean we took some but it was it was just like the vibe was just gone <laughs> So yeah, that's why it kind of ends. It's a little bit short of a video. I'm sorry. I wanted it to be a little bit more interesting, but that's, I guess, just how street photography is sometimes, right? So yeah, thanks for watching this video. Um, thanks, Yusuke, for joining me in this video. And thank you for incorporating. I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, goodbye.